I'm Anne Ogden Gaffney and today we're going to be making a really really easy and delicious uh, side dish or dip really for your summer barbecue baba ganoush which is made from eggplant and yogurt and more traditionally tahini but we're going to be making it with something you're going to find in your cupboard peanut butter okay you can make it with almond butter too get yourself a nice plump eggplant you can use whatever you like now if you are barbecuing you can literally just set this on the grill but make sure to keep turning it until it's nice and charred all over and very very soft but you can make it in the oven at home which is what we're going to do here today now the first thing you need to do is just to make little cuts into the eggplant these little cuts that we're making here whoops will stop the eggplant from exploding literally because they will swell up as it get as it as it roasts or grills and it's a good thing just to let the air out I'm just going to set it onto um, onto it onto a piece of parchment paper this I always use this when I'm roasting what anything in the oven because it keeps it clean obviously if you're putting it straight onto the grill you just put it onto the grill as is like this you don't need to put any oil on it anything just put it straight onto the grill so I'm just going to put this in there and I'm going to cook it for about oh, about 30 to 40 minutes at um, at 400 degrees in the oven until it's really soft now I've got one that I've already cooked here so I can show you this is how they end up being so it's it got pretty charred on one side so what I'm going to do now is start to to uh, put the butter together first of all I'm going to chop some garlic together with some salt like here so I'm going to put some salt in there okay so that's small enough for where we want it to be right now let's push it to one side now we're going to get the baba slit the eggplant open there you go you can see how it is and just pull all of that out I'm going to chop it together with all the garlic that we had there. And this, by the way, is kind of a good way to use up eggplant that you might have that might be just a little bit old or soft, actually. Okay. So I'm going to put in about two thirds of this. This is Greek yogurt. We've got everything measured out here for a full recipe, but actually I've got a little bit less than that here. I'm going to put in some lemon zest. Okay, a little bit of lemon juice. Again, about half of this is going in here. And last but not least, magic ingredient, unsalted, uh, unsalted unsweetened peanut butter, the smooth one. You can put almond butter in as well. It's um, pretty good with that. And of course, you can put in um, tahini. Is made from uh, tahini is made from sesame seeds but it's kind of great to be able to make something like this you know you think oh I have to have the right ingredients well there are no like right ingredients this is okay it's going to taste for salt mm, it's good 
Now, this is essentially ready. Let's put a tiny bit more lemon in there. All you need to do now is to let it sit in the fridge um, for about 30 minutes for the flavors to blend. And then you just eat it with some uh, homemade pita chips. Or tortilla chips, whatever. Okay. And baba ganoush.